Uh, it's where a young person can learn skills in the state of West Virginia, in the United States, and put them to work right here in Argentina. Uh, so Gino uh, Tuberl, who's here today, where's Gino? S somewhere. There you go. There we go. All right. Gino. So, so Gino is a great example. Uh, he, he was tinkering with 3D printing as a teenager when through the U.S. Embassy he participated in the National Youth Science Camp in West Virginia. Then he learned the latest 3D printing technology. When he came home to Argentina, he co-founded a company uh, that used these new skills. He received a request from a woman looking for a prosthetic hand for her young son, Felipe. And, and typically, those, those hands uh, can cost tens of thousands of American dollars. Gino printed a new hand for Felipe for far less. Just a few weeks later, for the first time, Felipe could ride a bike, go fishing, do many of the things that normal children do. And since then, more than a thousand Argentinians have signed up for Gino's help. So that's what's possible when we work together. That's what, what's possible when we invest in long, young people like all of you.